going on everyone? Welcome to another episode of High Side Guys Inside. So right now guys, um, I'm on my way to one of the few Burger Kings, if not the only Burger King left in Okinawa. And uh, it's the first time eating here, or it's gonna be the first time eating there. Even after all these years, I've never ever been to Burger King in Okinawa. There was one in Chiten, in Chiten Town, but it got shut down before I even got to go there. So this is gonna be an interesting one. And obviously this is another food review. Another one. And let's see how it goes. I'm here at this Burger King in Urasue, near uh, Camp Kinsler. And it is, the line is super long. I'm literally trying to get into the line and I'm in the middle of Route 58. This is, this is crazy. What in the world is this? I've never seen this place this crowded before. Never ever. Wow. Put on my mask real quick. assuming for lack of sales but if it's this crowded I don't understand why and I'm and I'm pretty interested in trying this out because McDonald's in, in Japan is, is simply amazing it's way better than anything you can have in the States and uh, I'm wondering if Burger King will be the same way too I've tried Burger King in other uh, East Asian countries but not in Japan Must be really popular in the weekends or something. I've seen like they have um, oh they even have like a chicken beef mixed number nine number ten interesting hi hi on a Wapa Junior King Value set top correct Wapa Junior set top one two three hi what's up um Sprite please Sprite please Yes, 
So I ordered a Whopper Jr. I'm not trying to eat too much right now. Eat too much junk food, you know. These food reviews. But I'm kind of really interested in how it tastes. So the menu looks like pretty much the same. Or not the same, but similar to a lot of McDonald's that I've seen. But I just want to know the taste of it, you know. Like, because I know that McDonald's, uh, McDonald's in uh, Japan, it tastes the beef patties more fresh. The fries are amazing. So I'm just kind of excited to see how how different it is from American Burger King. Get my card ready. It's crowded in here though. I guess I guess Burger King is pretty popular, but for some reason they only have like two two locations, vastly uh, far from each other. Maybe it's just a novelty item, you know, just to have a Burger King in Japan. I don't know why, or a Burger King in Okinawa rather, not in Japan, in and of its entirety. But uh, it's pretty interesting. I guess I guess there is I guess McDonald's is keeping them out or something. Because I would never believe that it would have been this crowded today just to get a burger, a fast food burger, you know, that's not even that gourmet. Maybe it's better than, maybe it's better than the McDonald's burger, but we gotta, we gotta see. And there's like no parking in here. Three hours later. I'm gonna look into this. I wonder why there's so few Burger Kings here because it's it's definitely not for the lack of customers. I can tell you that. I tell you, the line literally was out was out into the highway, and I just don't know why. So I mean, it's not for lack of customer because they have a bunch of customers right now. But it's it's kind of interesting. absolutely no parking here and then we'll see what this Burger King in Okinawa is all about catch you in a bit so guys I'm all the way in uh, Senega Island and I'm going to do this little food review on uh, Burger King in Okinawa first time having it oh wow okay so it's a regular Burger King bag that you can expect from any Burger King around the world. I got this little cup, I believe, for uh, ketchup. Really convenient. And then I got this uh, Whopper Jr. Hot outside, hot and humid. So, it's a typical Whopper Jr. that you would expect from any Burger King. You got your onion, you got your beef patty, you got your lettuce, tomato, and ketchup, and all that, all that stuff. Ooh, plane is about to take off. But here goes nothing. Let's try it out. Itadakimasu. Hmm. 
it's not bad one thing for sure it's much more lighter than an American Burger King if that makes sense like the beef patty it doesn't taste it doesn't have that heavy smoke smell smoky smoky taste rather one more bite That's good. Nothing super spectacular, but it is, it is, it, it tastes a little bit more, I don't know, fresh than the American style Burger Kings on base. Tissue to wipe it down. And in spite of the pandemic, there seems like there's a lot of tourists here too. But that's neither here nor there. But let's try out the fries. fries are definitely more fresh than the ones that I remember from one base or in the States. But other than that, Burger King is pretty much the same in the States as it is in Okinawa at least, or in that particular uh, Burger King. Overall, I'll give it, you know, a 6 out of 10. You know, Burger King is Burger King. If you want a decent burger or something quick to eat, you know, you can't go wrong with Burger King. But outside of that, there's nothing really too spectacular with it. And with that being said, guys, that's all I have for today. Remember to stay blessed and stay tuned. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.